One of your many milestone moments has arrived. Congratulations on graduating. This past year has presented many challenges, but you've remained resilient. Time passes quickly and life can become hectic. Live in this moment of celebration and find joy in the spaces that you work and play. Thank you for joining and being a part of the BAE family. You are a large part of our successes and we will be better for the great work you do in our profession every day. Again, congratulations and go Pokes. Hello, my name is Courtney Andrews. My parents are Wes and Missy Andrews. I'm originally from Stillwater, Oklahoma and my option within Biosystems is Environment and Natural Resources. Uh, after graduation, I've accepted a for entry-level engineering position with Friesen Nichols in Oklahoma City, and I will be working with their water engineering team, helping to ensure that Oklahoma has a safe, uh, steady supply of water. And throughout these four years at Oklahoma State University, I have gathered a lot of really good memories, so it's hard to pick some of my favorites. But I think my all-time favorite one was something that happened my sophomore year. I was very involved in homecoming that year, uh, so an organization I was a part of did a float for the annual homecoming parade, and our theme was space. So I got to dress up in this NASA astronaut costume and walk in the parade alongside our float. And at one point in the parade in the crowd was this little boy, and he was in this bright orange astronaut outfit. And he saw me in my costume, and his eyes just lit up, and his mouth kind of opened a little, and you could just tell he was in shock and awe and he just stared at me as I walked by and my heart was so warm. So I think uh, over the four years that has to be my favorite memory and it was something that was completely unexpected uh, but still just as wonderful. My name is Jacob Auer. Uh, my parents' names are Karen Auer and Rich Auer. Uh, I'm from the town of Lenapaw, Oklahoma and my option is machine systems and agricultural engineering. One of my favorite memories from uh, biosystems is working on senior design with my teammates Matt and Will. Um, a couple times we had some pretty late nights out working on the machine but those were the best nights um, when it would get dark and we'd have to turn on the trucks and, and shine lights on the machine just so we could work on it. Um, working with them and making those memories is probably one of my favorite uh, memories from, from biosystems. Another memory I have is uh, when I was younger, when I was a sophomore, um, I was taking Calculus 3 and I um, did not feel very confident about the class. It was a very difficult class, and so I had to do very well in the final. And one of my classmates um, worked for the Math Learning Success Center here on campus, and um, he offered to let us use the MLSC pretty late into the night, studying for our final the next day. And we ended up staying there the entire night studying, um, and then left in the morning to go take our final. And uh, I'll never forget that, because we were the only ones in there, and, and we studied all night for that exam. And, um, I ended up doing pretty well on it, so I'm glad that we did that. Um, after graduation, my plans are to attend graduate school and obtain a master's in international agricultural development from the University of California, Davis. Um, as I do that, I'll also be participating in a fellowship program through the U.S. Agency for International Development that helps with grad school and offer, offers me job placement afterwards working for them as a foreign service officer. So those are my plans after graduation. My name is Sydney Cannon. My parents are Kathy and Jerry Cannon, and I'm originally from Newcastle, Oklahoma, um, and I am uh, studying the Biosystems Engineering General Option. Post-graduation, I'll be interning with Cargill this summer at one of their protein facilities before um, taking a year off and then going to grad school for um, Biosystems Engineering. I am I'm looking at moving home for about four months and then I'm in contact with a couple horse farms in Australia I'm trying to get a sales position um, for the spring. And just a couple of my favorite memories from the past several years, um, one of them being a member of the 2020 World Champion Horse Judging Team. And then I've been thinking a lot recently about after our BAE labs I'm going to have lunch with some of my classmates every week. And then, of course, all of the times that we spent together up in 208, uh, studying or not studying, um, and just the time that we all spent together. 
Hello, my name is Jordan Dickey, um, and my parents are John and Georgian Dickey, and I am from Stillwater, Oklahoma. Um, and my option here at BAE is pre-medical. And so part of my um, BA experience, maybe my favorite one, is working on different projects. Um, so I was involved as a research um, intern and also uh, just working on different class projects for different classes. Um, and I think that really helped me um, solidify what I wanted to do post-graduation was to research. And so um, after graduation, I'm going to be attending the University of Oklahoma um, with a major in to get my MS in biomedical engineering. I'll be working um, with a neurologist and an instructor there uh, to do stroke research. My name is Seth Durham and I'm from Edmond, Oklahoma. My parents are Christy Durham and Howard Durham and I am the environmental and natural resources option of biosystems engineering. So my favorite memory I have to say uh, of the department and of the major in general has to be when we went to rally in Kentucky, our professional conference that we have every year. Um, it was it was a great time. It started snowing there, um, and we got to play some indoor sand volleyball at a local establishment. Great, great time just uh, being able to network with, with lots of students and professionals from all across the southeast. My post-graduation plans um, are that I want to work in developing nations, helping with water quality and sustainable agriculture. My name is Will Ellison. I'm the son of uh, Shane and Michelle Ellison, um, and I grew up on a small cattle ranch in Fitzhugh, Oklahoma. Uh, it's close to Ada. And um, just here at uh, Biosystems and Agriculture Engineering, my option uh, that I chose to take is the machine systems option. It just kind of fit my background in loving to weld stuff together on farm equipment or whatever to make it work. And it actually has been quite uh, involving um, of me and taught me lots of neat terms that I can go back home and share with my dad and stuff. So that's been really cool. Um, as far as my whole time here at OSU, uh, I was asked to provide three special memories that, that I hold, and I really couldn't come up with three, but my time here, the best places that I can think of is, first off, me working at the design and manufacturing lab on campus. I help assist students um, in learning how to use lathes and mills. I've enjoyed that. I have enjoyed taking classes here in the biosystems, especially Dr. Long's classes in Aganoff Road, and then machinery. Uh, those were great instruments and controls, uh, biomaterials, all of those were great classes. Just a lot of good memories there. And then probably some of the last ones that, you know, are gonna go with me from here on out is just working in Cowboy Motorsports as the director uh, working to, de to s design and build a quarter scale size tractor when they give you nothing but the back tires and an engine. And you get to see the whole process, ins and outs, work at mower clinics, go walk in the parade at, uh, at the time of homecoming. All that's just really cool. So that's kind of about me and uh, I have enjoyed my time here at Oklahoma State University. After graduation, I uh, I really don't have a plan currently. Uh, what I hope for is a job that I can apply my class subjects, uh, basically not as you know specifying an area like going to work for a tractor company on you know special systems involving the ergonomics of you know the operator station or plow blades or some kind of mechanism there and specializing, but going and kind of being a test engineer, and finding a whole different diverse. Uh, things that I can put my mind to because I like doing a little bit of electronics. I like doing a little bit of you know mechanics I like doing a little bit of welding get out in the shop and do some hands-on stuff I don't want to sit in an office and do computer work all the time. So that's a job. I'm looking for I mean It'd be great if I could get in with the Choctaw Nation since they have provided a lot of my education funding um, But past that I'm kind of open for whatever whatever is in store for me at the it doesn't matter as long as I'm doing, you know, biosystem and agriculture engineering and something related. I think it'll be pretty, pretty cool.
Hi, I'm Jack Godfrey. Uh, my parents are John and Gina Godfrey. I'm from Broken Arrow, Oklahoma, um, and I'm in the Environmental and Natural Resources option. Uh, one of my favorite memories from OSU was directing Spring Sing and Freshman Follies and winning those uh, shows. Um, and currently I'm seeking employment uh, with water or environmental engineering uh, in the future. My name is Roy Hayden. My parents are Billy and Lynn Hayden, and I'm from Amarillo, Texas. My major option is environmental and natural resources. My favorite memory here at OSU is just playing uh, intramural sports. My post-graduation plans are to work here in Stillwater for the USDA. My name is Natalie Hoddy. My parents are Sherry and David Hoddy, and I am from Richardson, Texas. I am doing the natural resources and environment option. One of my favorite memories at OSU has been getting to study abroad in Cork, Ireland for a semester. Um, I got to travel a lot of places, try a lot of new things, um, take some classes over there, um, and it was a really unique experience. Um, some of my favorite parts of BAE have actually been during the senior design process, just getting closer with my team. Um, it's been really challenging and stressful at times, but also really fun. I have been applying to grad school, so after graduation I will hopefully be continuing my education and studying um, natural resources and development. My name is min Kim, and my parents are Sukja Kwon and Jonggun Kim, and I'm from South Korea, and my, I'm majoring in biosystems engineering, and my option is bioprocessing and food engineering. I uh, did KSA, like Korean Student Association, and I was treasurer of KSA at that time. KSA held a lot of international events, and I also joined to the event. Actually, it, it was really hard, but it was exciting. I can experience a lot of other countries' culture, senior design, Actually, uh, my senior design project topic is livestock issues. Actually, I'm not, I was not familiar with this topic. I've never heard about this topic before the class. So I was struggled to find out how, how to contribute to my team and what, it, what is the livestock issues. But my teammates have helped me a lot, so I made it. <laughs> I will go to University of Florida in, in a master degree, and so I'll, I'm going to study bioprocessing for two years. My name is Preston Lee. My parents are Brian Lee and Julie Lee. I'm from Grapevine, Texas, and my degree option is environmental and natural resources. One of my fondest memories of coming to Oklahoma State and being a member of the BAE department is being how the uh, department is a small uh, group of people and you're able to connect with all the students and staff a lot easier and being able to network and connect with everyone in a much broader and much tighter manner. I also enjoy uh, being able to use the BAE lab upstairs and being able to uh, communicate and uh, mingle with the students and staff whenever you have the availability and the freedom to do that and not have to worry about uh, forcing your way into something, you have the availability and the freedom to do that since there's not too busy all the time. Hi, my name is Rosie Rosales. I am doing the environmental natural resource option. My parents are Hippolyta Rojo and Jose Rosales. I am from Tulsa, Oklahoma. Uh, one of my favorite memories here at OSU would be attending the annual Mr. and Ms. Hispanic pageant that occurs every, every year. Uh, another favorite memory I would have is having the opportunity to serve as president for the Society of Hispanic Professional Engineers. Um, for graduation, I will be moving back to Tulsa and I will be looking for job opportunities there. My name is Trinity Smith. My parents are Dave and Stephanie Smith. I'm originally from Sunbury, Ohio, and I am in the food and bioprocessing option in biosystems. Um, some of my favorite memories of being at um, at OSU have been joining the meat judging team and getting to experience that whole year um, with all my teammates um, as well as being able to build some great um, friendships throughout the biosystems department. Um, we've been a very close group from the beginning because our department is so small 
um, and being able to spend some time with everyone up in 206 and 208, um, getting to know each other and working on, through classes together. Um, after graduation, I plan on attending Oklahoma State University to pursue a master's in food science. My name is Matt Studevin. I, my parents are John and Jeanette Studevin. I'm from Tremont, Illinois. Uh, I'm a machine systems option. Um, and my favorite biosystems memory is probably working on the uh, drill rig and senior design and uh, seeing Will break open a hydraulic hose and swallow a whole bunch of propylene glycol out of it because it was a pressurized line. And uh, uh, after graduation, I'm planning on going to work for a startup called Natural Fiber Welding out of Peoria, Illinois. Uh, my name is Josh Tabor. Uh, my parents are Amy and Ronnie Tabor. I'm from Sand Springs, Oklahoma. My major is Environmental and Natural Resources. Some of my favorite memories include uh, attending sporting events and uh, playing intramural sports. Uh, Post-graduation, I plan on working at Garver as a project engineer in their Fayetteville office. Hello, my name is Cameron Taylor. Um, I'm a biosystems engineering student. My parents are Shane and Jacqueline Taylor, and I'm from Grove, Oklahoma, which is northeast Oklahoma. Um, I'm in the environment and natural resources option here at OSU. Um, some of my favorite memories include both ASABE, BAE, and just general OSU memories. My favorite memory of all time is probably my first football game. I was in the cowboy marching band, and it, I was very nervous coming out onto the field for pregame. Uh, the, the fans were going crazy. It was so loud and OSU spirit all in the air. Um, so it was just just amazing moment for me. And I let out my first note, and it was just euphoric. Um, so that was probably my favorite OSU memory. And then some of my BAE memories is mostly just working with other team, with, with teams, with senior design, instruments controls, hanging out in the lounge upstairs and in the lab. And those are some good memories there. Um, so post-graduation, I will be working with Cowan Group Engineering as a civil engineering and training. Um, I will be living in OKC. Um, I will get, be getting married in October. So that's also very exciting. I'm Tyler Walterscheid. Uh, I'm from Munster, Texas. Uh, my parents are Wade and Rhonda Walterscheid. Um, I'm the machine systems and agricultural engineering option. Um, my One of my favorite memories here at OSU would have been the BAE back to school uh, picnic that they have every year. My post-graduation plans are to uh, pursue an internship this summer and hopefully get a job with that same company later on. My name is Mayam Samimi. I am from Iran. I have got my PhD in Biosystems Engineering from Oklahoma State University. The reason I came to uh, OSU is that my advisor accepted a position in uh, the Department of Biosystems and Agricultural Engineering in this university and he, su he suggested me that um, I apply here so that uh, we could uh, continue working on his research together. I studied a little bit about the university and applied here and got accepted. And I'm glad that I made that decision uh, because I have had so many opportunities to learn and to grow in Oklahoma State University. Uh, I have also had a lot of good memories here, uh, but one of the best ones is my hooding ceremony. Uh, you know, when I uh, came here, I was thinking that I'm not going to go to my graduation ceremony because my family and my loved ones are not here and uh, I don't have anyone to celebrate it with. So I was thinking that it doesn't make sense for me to go there and stand, it, stand by myself. Uh, but in 2020, the pandemic happened and everything got canceled. However, the university and the graduate college decided to throw us this uh, hooding ceremony. Uh, we got a couple of emails from the 
a graduate college from our graduate coordinator in the department and I decided to go there so I got the gown I went there and everybody from the graduate college were there they were excited and happy and they have planned all these occasions and they have been there to celebrate it with us like a family so it felt so good and I will never forget that day and I'm always grateful that I have the opportunity to be part of the Cowboys family because Cowboys and Cowgirls always got together and helped each other to go through the hard times. And that's what I'm grateful for and that's what I will never forget through my life. Go Cowboys. Hello, good afternoon. My name is Yinka Augustina Desmayer. I hail from Ibadan, Oyo State, Nigeria, where I was born. And um, while in Nigeria, I graduated from Federal University of Technology, Akure, for my first degree. After my first degree, I got employed as an assistant lecturer at the Federal University of Ekiti, Ekiti State, Nigeria. My employment as an assistant lecturer prompted me to pursue knowledge more. So that led me to study agricultural and environmental engineering at the University of Ibadan, Ibadan, Nigeria, where I badged a master's degree in agricultural and environmental engineering. The, my project was successful and um, despite the fact that I recorded little bits of sources, that prompted me to come to the U.S. where I know that there are lots of biofuel industries and lots of research are going on on biofuel production. But I chose Oklahoma State University, OSU Stillwater, because of the landmark achievement of my would-be supervisor then who is currently supervising my PhD, Dr. Azan Atiye. I realized that Dr. Azan Atiye has achieved a lot in this field. In, so I came here at fall 2017. I joined OSU Biosystems and Agricultural Engineering Department for my, second master, for my second master's degree in fall 2017. So I graduated that, I graduated fall 2019. So during my, during my master's days, I was able to optimize butanol and ethanol production from switchgrass. So due to the successes I achieved during my master's degree, my supervisor deemed it fit that I should continue on the program. That's why, that's what brought me here. Right now, I'm a PhD student in the same lab that I got my master's degree from. I enjoy game days a lot. I enjoy game days. Game days are always busy. Several they'll get in several they'll get in sports, then enjoy the football. Sometimes always you win. Honestly, to, to tell you the, to tell you that, as a matter of fact, I'm not always happy when they lose. I'm so emotional when it comes to sports. Once I'm supporting a team. I don't, I don't, I hate to see my team lose. The memory could linger for days. So I'm, a, I'm, I'm an addict fan of OSU football. Hi, uh, my name is Shimon Dutta. Uh, my hometown, my country is in the southeast corner of Asia, a country in Bangladesh. It's a really densely populated country. And uh, my hometown is in uh, the northern part of the country uh, called Maman Singh. So what drew to me drew me to Oklahoma State University is that uh, in 2016 when I was attending uh, ACB annual international meeting, uh, so that's the home conference of ag engineers. So I saw a large uh, graduate student population at that conference from Oklahoma State. Uh, secondly, I got to attend some of the meetings, some of the presentations from Dr. Salat Agwayan, and I really liked that. And the thirdly, the fact is that uh, Dr. Tagwayan's group was doing uh, applied research that pertained to 
benefits of the stakeholders of Oklahoma, which is our farmers. So considering all of these facts, um, uh, they all drew me to pursue my PhD in uh, biosystems and ag engineering at Oklahoma State University. So I studied uh, measurement and modeling, numerical modeling techniques uh, to monitor irrigation management variables to conserve water in irrigated agriculture. I graduated in the May of 2020, uh, and uh, some of my there are there are many uh, fondest memories uh, in Oklahoma State. So some of the some examples are uh, when I got to teach a class for the first time, then uh, when I won uh, the table tennis tournament uh, that is organized by uh, international students. All of the research trips that we take and with all of our research team members, so they were really fun. Hi. I am Ali Ajaz. My hometown is Lahore, Pakistan. I am currently working at Texas Water Resources Institute as Irrigation Extension Specialist. What drew me to OSU Graduate School is one of the finest ag water management programs being offered in the US. I studied biosystems and ag engineering with focus on drought management and crop water productivity modeling. And my PhD advisor was Dr. Saleh Tagwayan. And I graduated in July 2020. Some of the fondest memories. Uh, well, field work is among some of the great memories I made uh, during my time at OSU. So we used to go into the fields during spring and summertime, installing sensors uh, in the farms and working together as a team and eventually digging them out at the end of the cropping season. Uh, it was fun and I learned a lot of new things about sensor installation for irrigation scheduling. And other memory I have is our trip to uh, Illinois River. Uh, we went there uh, in 2017. It's on the southeastern part of Oklahoma. And we were there for a stream cleanup trip. Uh, we cleaned the stream banks while kayaking in the river. And overall, the uh, time I spent at OSU has definitely helped me to grow professionally and to develop the skills required to advance in my career. And, and I'm thankful to Dr. Saleh and other faculty members for all their support and guidance they provided. Thank you.